Olu again, nuggets of wisdom, quick money, inspirational for you. Brothers, 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 sisters, lean in. I got a word for you this morning. No gods, no glory. I say that. No gods, no glory. I was driving yesterday and I listened to this audio book about King Edward and Wally Simpson. King Edward was the king of England that followed a divorcee, an American divorcee, in 1937 to abdicate his throne so he could marry a divorcee. You may say, Olu, what does that have to do with what I'm talking about? Whatever you're saying, this is 2022. This happened in 1937, and I'm talking about it. That means that man, King Edward, had enough guts to leave what deemed comfortable for something that he really wanted. And you may say in 2022, hell no, I ain't going to do that. I'm going to be a king of a place. I'm going to leave it up. But you know what? He had enough guts to do it. My question to you, my brothers and sisters, what do you have the guts to do? Can you really, really do it? Can you really, really have those guts to do those things that are uncomfortable for you to do? Do you have what it takes to have the guts to finally receive glory? The in-between of it, there may not be glory. There may be people talking down to you. There may be people disrespecting you. There may be people talking to you, you're stupid for doing what you want to do. But you have guts enough to go after whatever you want to go after. Do not let get twisted. You can't have glory without guts. You can't move forward. You see, the spoils belong to the guys who win the war, who win the battle. Are you willing to have guts to get the glory? All the way again, man. Just a food for thought this morning. God bless you. I'm out.